It's Saturday and we're gonna go do Advent. And Glenn is very excited. Here I come. Here comes Mama. Do you wanna do Advent? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go do Advent, come on. All right, Mr. Flynn, here it comes. No. <gasps> Remember, he snuck one last night. I don't see 19 on here. It looks like he might have already stolen 19. She said, we are like, why is he being so quiet? He definitely stole one last night. Oh, you know what? He stole, yeah, it's gone. 19 is gone from this one, so you can have one of the little men. You get all these. Whoa, cool. Whoa, Flynn. Oh. Last night it was quiet for a minute. In a wheelbarrow? And we were like, Flynn? And That's we turn around and he comes running over to us Mom? with a dump truck yeah. that he stole from this. So he stole today's. All right, let's go get, I'll go get you more. I'll go get your other one. Here we go. <gasps> oh, it's gonna be a good one, I can tell. Keep it open, what is it? <gasps> forklift! Oh, Flynn. A Let's see what mama got today. Oh, Flynn, it's a tiny square. I have a feeling. <laughs> it's a tile, a tiny tile. What a lame gift from my advent today. What is it? It's a little tiny tile. A singular tile? A singular tile. Oh. Now it's time for the advent calendar of kindness. Talk to an elderly person when you're given a chance. Anyway, a simple hi followed by a question or a compliment can make their day. That's nice. Okay. Wanna help me with this one? Mmm, that's a good one. What do you think? Yeah. Can you put that on your lips? Mmm, pretty. It's mm. so pretty, Flynn. Ooh, it is an interesting feel to it. Ta -da! It's on my teeth. Time for nap. Okay, so um, right now I'm about to film a little video. I'm doing a little song to send to an awesome little fundraiser to raise money for Family Reach, which is the organization where a lot of the money that we raised went to. Um, so I'm doing that right now to send to them. Then I have to work on a little crafty craft for something that I don't know how to tell you about yet, so you don't get to watch that. But I'll see you guys a little later. <laughs> we have been lining up. Yay! 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 I'm fixing. Wait, that's orange. Where does the orange one go? Hmm. Mm, you gotta find. Those are yellow. No. Those are the yellow ones. Where does the orange one go, Flynn? Mm. With blue and green. Mm. Boom! You did it. We're lining up. Yay! You need one right there? Yeah. Can you find any red cars? We're lining up all of Flynn's cars to be color coordinated. Don't know why, it's just what happened. But he just dumped out a puzzle, so I think we're about to do a puzzle. Ooh, that's a good one. Yeah. Wait, where it goes? Flynn, how can you help me with that one? Yeah. A good guess. Go great. 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 Go great job, Flynn. Yeah. Yeah. Great. Great. One oh, more, Flynn. The last one more. one more. Yay! Yay! We did it! We did it! Yay! Great! Great! I'm making a mess, but I can't show you what I'm making yet. You'll know very soon. It's just a new like project thing that's gonna be coming out soon. And um, so my house is a disaster because I'm trying to prep for that. And I haven't vlogged much today because I've been doing that. But I do have some yummy treats because I made these for my brother and sister-in-law and I kept some for myself. Oh good. Butterscotch, peanut butter, chocolate, crunchiness. It's delicious. Hey guys, I need you to get off of this. Gus? 
Guess. This isn't your new bed. You need to move. I laid this stuff down. I'm about to tape it all down to this like board or project we're doing. And of course, I go put Flynn to sleep and the second I come down, both cats are just like, oh, this is mine. This is mine now. Hi, beautiful humans. So I spent most of my day and night, it's now 12.30 in the morning, uh, working on this new project that we're working on. I was like, oh, I don't think I filmed anything today. And for some reason, my mind thought about the audition tape of Eric when he auditioned for Haters Back Off, which is how we met. We met because he auditioned for my Netflix show. And I was like, I haven't watched that in so long. I wanna see if I have it. And I just found it. I like went deep into my emails and I found it. And he doesn't know, but I'm about to watch it and react to it. I'm so excited. I'm also really tired. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Hey, Brynn. Sorry, your videos. Everything okay? Oh, it's better than all came back, Trey. I just need to give up on fame, and I'm gonna start focusing on the more important things in life, finding true love. True love? Uh, did, did, did you have anyone in, in particular? Oh, hi, I'm Miranda. Right on, catch you around, Amanda. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, I don't even know what to say. It's so weird, because it doesn't even look like him. It doesn't look like him. He's, he's such a good actor. Like, when he acts, it's like, I don't see Eric at all. I just see the character. And that's why he got Patrick, because he came in and I immediately was like, he's literally exactly what I envisioned Patrick to be. And then he did the scene and I was like, oh my God, he's literally Patrick. Like there was no question. And it's so funny knowing him now because he's obviously nothing like the character, but it's just, I don't know, it's so fascinating. He's so good. I want to see the other one. I know, I know that you're the mother. So you have first dibs at consoling her, but I, I, I would love to be second in line for that. She needs you. <laughs> this scene got deleted. We didn't, or we changed it or something. Yeah, I don't think this scene is in the show. Fun fact, I have not watched Haters Back Off since it came out. So it's been quite a few years since I've seen it, so I don't remember, but I'm pretty sure this scene completely changed or got cut. What do I do? Uh, go help her. Tell her how you really feel. Then take her somewhere far away and keep her there for the next four to six hours. Four to six hours? It's incredible. Is Macy feeling better? Oh, I think your singing voice is beautiful. Mm -hmm. Pure. And anyone will be lucky. Aww. That was his first audition. He was the first person to come in for Patrick. We immediately were like, that's it, we're done. I knew we were auditioning Patrick's that day and he came in and he was the first person we saw and he walked out of the room and all of us, all the producers were all like, well, that's him. That's obviously Patrick, he's perfect. It was crazy because he literally did things I imagine in my brain that Patrick would do. I thought I heard the baby crying, it's the cat crying. But I remember thinking when we were writing the character, like in the script, I remember thinking like, this kid like talks through his teeth. Like I remember just like thinking like such specific things about the character that I wanted him to do, like to like think really hard and like close his eyes and talk through his teeth like this and kind of mumble. Everything I had envisioned the character to do, he just did at the audition without us saying anything. Like everything I thought Patrick should be, he just did it. I was like, how, is he in my brain? Like how did he know exactly what I wanted this character to be. It's so weird because like, I remember sitting in that ca casting office and watching all the auditions. I remember seeing him and thinking, oh, he's a great Patrick. Like never in my wildest dreams in my mind, anywhere in my mind, was there a thought like this person, you're eventually gonna be married to this person, have a kid with him. Like, what? Are you kidding me? Like, it's so weird because my mind has categorized like this time in life, like this audition. I remember seeing it in person and being there for it and thinking he was super talented, but just being like, this is Patrick. Like, it's so weird because my mind's going like, it's like having malfunctions right now. Cause I'm like, my brain remembers this as like this person I cast in my show. But now I'm looking at him as his wife with his child going like, I can't believe that this person that I remember from this audition is now I'm married to him. What? Like, it's so weird to watch this. It just feels like such a lifetime ago, a different life, a different experience it's so bizarre to watch this and see i don't know it's just so weird like i didn't know him at all i just knew he was talented and he was perfect for the role of patrick so then he had to come back because um netflix how auditions you know you get a call back whatever and if you have like a romantic part or a part where you need to have chemistry with someone you have to do a chemistry read and so then he had to read it with me next day when we had to like improv together i mean this is like literally the first time i ever spoke to him was on camera for this callback i don't remember how this went but we're gonna find out hi 
I, uh, I was, um, at home, I was practicing magic, yeah, I was watching my videos, and just, um, are you okay? Oh, I am great. <laughs> Don't you worry a lot about me, Patrick. <laughs> There's lots of things I need to focus on, and TV eating, more things. Oh, food, I food's delicious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hi! Hi, you're all in light. Hi, hi. Hi, right on, catch your round, Amanda. It's a nickname we have together. I have a nickname for it. You do? Yeah. Precious. What? <laughs> Precious. Please. Amanda? <laughs> <laughs> You're supposed to call me that. That's our special thing. Now every time he calls me that, I'm going to think of you. Andrew, you're doing that creepy smile. <laughs> it's making me really uncomfortable. Can you turn around? I just don't. I'm going to leave. <laughs> remember this so crazy now I just want to like go and watch every audition what a life I have had holy smokes all right well I'm gonna get some editing done and then go to bed but that just blew my mind oh my god wild wild all right I love you guys I guess I'll see you tomorrow oh my god it's almost Christmas I have so much to do okay love you see you tomorrow